Good afternoon, Dobroden. My name is uh, Cosmin Patroi. I'm the CEO of Terasti Romania and uh, Serbia. Just a short introdu introduction. Terastel is a sandwich panel producer of poor PAR and uh, mineral wool sandwich panels. But besides this, we are producing high trappers for load bearing and uh, purlings, CZ, uh, Stigma, U profiles, everything for uh, modular building. We have three factories, two in Romania in Bistrița, in, uh, one in uh, Leskovac in uh, Serbia. And altogether, we are selling currently in 25 uh, countries uh, uh, around Europe. So we have quite uh, a big portfolio. And uh, considering all this portfolio, we, we develop new, new products. And this is what I would like to present today shortly. A new concept regarding the Terra Steel buildings lead by Terra Steel, developed together with Dow, uh, Dow Chemicals. And uh, first of all, I would like to invite you to see a presentation movie. Not. This is the new, the new building that we created in, in Terrastil with uh, our partners. So, and now I would like to uh, go a little bit through the six main characteristics of these uh, buildings, uh, turnkey projects. So first of all, we are using the magnesium aluminum zinc coating for the, for the steel structure. This ensure for the uh, per length, the zinc profiles uh, that we are using a 40 years warranty period. And besides this, the metal that we are using in the sandwich panel, it's the uh, uh, SSAB green coat coating material altogether also with uh, uh, 40 years warranty. Um, together with Dow Chemicals, we realize a better uh, foam for the PAR panels and we are calling the, the lead panels. And this is uh, ensuring for the product uh, better reaction to fire. All of us, we know, and we have to be careful that the, actually the fire reaction is saving the people's life in all the building. And besides this, this is a halogen-free product. All the cost, cost optimization of the building and how we call it, as you saw in the movie, it's done mainly by the re reusability of this building. So if we make a building, we use it 10, 15 years. Those are modular buildings. Uh, we can take them and uh, reuse roughly 70% of the, of the materials uh, in this building. And we can use it for 20, maybe 25 more years in another place for different, uh, for, uh, for different purposes. Um, the, the better form, the, uh, the better uh, polyurethanic foam that uh, we, uh, we did it, uh, the V plus perform, this is uh, uh, providing for the beneficiary a 20% better thermal insulation or 
for example, instead of using a 100 millimeter sandwich panel, we can use a 80 millimeter sandwich panel. In all these buildings, uh, we are not using screws. All together, have, having all this element, we are trying to help a little bit to reduce the carbon footprint of, uh, of, of the materials that uh, we are using. Uh, taking all these uh, uh, aspects in consideration, we try to, to come to help the architects to, to make more performant buildings and uh, to support them, uh, first of all, with the consultancy regarding our products. And uh, nevertheless, now uh, for the lead by Terastil, we did the beam object and this will help uh, everybody to, to win time and to have more accurate, uh, more accurate plans. Also to help the constructors and everybody who is coming after the architects in the building, we are trying to do all the deliveries and all the transportation of our goods on the sites. We call it like this as a complete solution. And here I would like to, to present you some buildings that we did in, uh, in Serbia, in Bulgaria, in, uh, in Bosnia. Uh, and uh, just, to make, uh, just to make an idea, those are buildings finished last year. And um, if you have questions, I'm here for, uh, I have answers. So I am here and I'm glad to, to answer to you. Otherwise, uh, we can be in touch uh, in, the, in the market. So thank you very much. Thank you very much, Cosmin, for a very insightful presentation. So I'll come back to Mr. Cosmin Petroyu, uh, who, who is the CEO of Terra Steel, a company from uh, Romania and uh, Serbia, uh, that um, it is the most important manufacturer of thermal insulation and the coated zinc structure in Central and Eastern Europe. Uh, and with their 15 years of activity in the field of construction, um, he, can, uh, he can give us some insight from uh, uh, his company and I would, uh, la I would ask him uh, how did the um, how did uh, this event, uh, this pandemic situation affected uh, your uh, business and what measures did you adopt it? Uh, I can say that uh, we are just immediately because, uh, first of all, because we are uh, a very united team and uh, quite young team. Uh, our uh, age is uh, roughly the average age in the company. It's, uh, roughly 40 years and we are a very digitalized company. So uh, what was not necessary to, to be in the factory or in the offices, uh, we, we switch immediately in uh, home office. And uh, even now we have uh, a part of our colleagues that can work from home. And uh, of course, the production, logistics, we had to take measures to, to work in the factories, both in Romania, also in Serbia. And we, we took all the measures and extra measures, like people not to meet and not to have uh, uh, contact. And we give all the material. So this was, uh, let's say, the easy part. The hard part was to work at their mentality to make them understand that this can be a very big problem. And uh, if they don't uh, act responsible, they, they, they uh, will affect all the other colleagues and companies and uh, the company and uh, our partners. So I can say that uh, we managed to work around the clock in the last uh, two months, but everything what means interaction, uh, the sales uh, with our clients, with architects and so on, Everything was done uh, only in uh, like this, in front of the computer or by phone. So uh, uh, we uh, we consider that for the time being, we we managed to uh, to to do a good uh, good uh, job. But it's clear for us that. Uh, all the working uh, system, it will be changed from now on. 
and we are trying to adapt ourselves and that's why we are uh, we are going very much into the the localization and digitalization actually i'm uh, making fun with my colleagues uh, we are calling the localization because we are trying to get close to our clients having factories or offices in different countries but actually the for us the localization was working from home so yeah this is what we did in uh, in the last two months and uh, we are prepared we are very flexible and uh, we 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 can change and adapt as a company towards our clients and to the situations in the market